Hi, I'm Christine. Welcome to Keep Exploring Kids. On our channel, we are going to share some great videos that help families get together, get outside, and play. We're hoping that you'll join us as we do some story times, create some play experiences, and go on some family adventures together. My husband, my daughter, and I are in this all together, and we hope that your family will join us. If you like our videos, we hope that you'll give us a big thumbs up, hit subscribe, and of course, hit that bell notification so that you're notified every time we post a brand new video. Hey everybody, I've got a new story for you today. It's called A Color of His Own by Leo Leonini. Probably mispronounced that. The Color of Our Own is about my friend, a chameleon. That's why my friend Pascal's here today with us. So, let's get started. Parrots are green. Goldfish are red. Elephants are gray. Pigs are pink. All animals have a color of their own. Except for chameleons. They change color wherever they go. On lemons, they are yellow. In the heather, they are purple. And on the tiger, they are striped like tigers. One day, a chameleon who was sitting on a tiger's tail said to himself, if I remain on a leaf, I shall be green forever. And so I too will have a color of my own. With this thought, he cheerfully climbed onto the greenest leaf. But in autumn, the leaf turned yellow, and so did the chameleon. Later, the leaf turned red, and the chameleon turned red too. And then, in the winter's wind, then the winter's wind blew the leaf from the branch. And with it, the chameleon. Oh no, my poor chameleon friend, he fell. The chameleon was black in the long winter night. But when spring came, he walked out into the green grass. And there he met another chameleon. He told his sad story. We won't ever have a color of our own. He, won't, won't we ever have a color of our own, he asked. Hmm. I'm afraid not, said the other chameleon, who was older and wiser. But, he added, why don't we stay together? We will still change color wherever we go, but you and I will always be alike. And so they remained side by side. They were green together, and purple, and yellow. With red and white polka dots, they lived, and they lived happily, ever after the end. So, my friends, this book talks an awful lot about colors. And I thought you might be able to do something fun today. Do you have a package of crayons? Does you, do your package of crayons have lots of different colors in it? Like the colors of the rainbow? Today's a great day to take a package of crayons outside, in your yard, or around your neighborhood for a walk, and see if you can find all the colors of the rainbow. Hmm, where could we look for something red? Maybe we see a robin with a crust on the ground. Orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, brown, black, white. I wonder how many colors you can find in your neighborhood. It will be a great way to get outside, stretch our legs, and enjoy some fresh air. I can't wait to hear about your adventures, so send me a comment and give me a big thumbs up if you enjoy your color walk here on YouTube. Have a great day.